A very good morning to all my dear ones. Today we are going to learn Max. In last class we have learned about shapes. Today we are going to learn about a new topic which is called spatial relationships. In a simple way we can say it is the position of an object or shapes or person or animals. It is the position. Let's discuss this topic with the help of some examples. See the first picture. Here there are three balls and the three balls has taken three different position. See the first one. In the first one where is the position of the ball? The ball is in the box. So see the next picture. Where is the ball? The ball is under the box. So the position, it has taken the position under the box. See the next picture. Where is the ball? The ball is on the box. So the ball has taken three different positions. Let's see some more examples with shapes. You can see the picture here. There is a square and circle. In the first picture, where is the position of circle? The circle is in the square. See the next one. Where is the position of the circle? Now it is under the square. So see the next one. Where is the position of the circle? The circle is on the square. So the same circle has taken three different positions. Let's see another example. Can you see a dog? It is outside the house. So we can say the dog is outside the house. The position is outside the house. See the next picture. The dog is inside the house. The position is inside the house. The same dog has taken two different positions. The next picture. You can see the picture of an aeroplane. The, in the first picture, you can see the aeroplane is above the cloud. And the second picture, you can see the aeroplane is below the cloud. See the next one. Can you see the ball? There is the position of the ball in the first picture. The ball is on top of the tree. See the second picture. There is a slide and a ball. And where is the position of the ball? The ball is at the bottom of the slide. Let's see one more example. There are two numbers. Number 4 and number 5. So what is the position of number 4? The number 4 comes before number 5. So what is the position of number 5? Number 5 comes after number 4. So both these numbers have their own position. So these are called spatial relationships. In a simple way we can say it is about the position of an object or position of a shape or person or animal etc. That's all for today. I hope you understood about the position. We'll meet in the next class. Till then, bye.